hey y'all I decided that I would make a quick video of how I make my guacamole and I'm actually like bent over right now because my tripod is this tall and I am this tall but um so real quick I'll just like go through the ingredients and then um just put it all together for you let's do it okay so I moved my camera I'll move you again to actually see the ingredients um but for this episode for this recipe I don't have any like tried and true measurements of what I do I just do as many avocados as we need to feed the family and then I add to that what looks good um as far as like tomato onion um, cilantro and lime so that's what I'm gonna do but today I have a set number of avocados so we're gonna do four avocados um, scooped out save the seeds I'm gonna do two Roma tomatoes and I don't know if tomatoes and guacamole is like a thing but I learned this I learned to put tomatoes in it from my aunt in Georgia and it's really good um, cilantro and this looks like probably a fourth a cup of onions because we're having enchiladas tonight for dinner and they have enchiladas in that or they have onion in them also so not too much onion and then um, I'm gonna do at least one lime juice maybe two I usually use um, our essential living our young living essential oils lime but I actually have limes that I need to use so I'll go ahead and use those but that's what we're gonna do and we're just gonna throw it together um, till it looks and tastes right and of course I forgot salt you always use salt and then like if you cook like me you just taste it every once in a while to see if it's right so that's what we're gonna do Okay, so that's done. Um, I want to mention, I didn't mention before, that you want to microwave your limes for about 30 seconds and then you saw me roll them on the counter. Um, that just makes it easier to juice. That way you're not trying to juice a cold, hard lime. Um, and also, I asked you to, I told you to save the seeds and that's because you're going to put, um, a seed for every avocado that you have in your guacamole just set it in there um, 
and so this is probably about three avocados in this little bowl that she's going to be taking so just three seeds in there with it then cover it with saran wrap and push the saran wrap down until there's no air in between the guacamole and the saran wrap and then put a lid on it and that will keep it from turning brown right away it won't stay that way for more than 24 hours so if you don't eat it eat it for lunch the next day but um that'll keep it turning brown and get it to its destination thanks for watching guys bye